A couple weeks ago, I made a video on Izanagi Rocket, and I made sure to write this in the title, anticipating the possibility that there's something I haven't tested that could output even higher DPS. A recent video brought to my attention that Double Slug could potentially output higher DPS than Izanagi Rocket, so in this video, I'm going to compare the two. The weapons I'm using for Double Slug are Heritage with Reconstruction, and First and Last Out with Auto Loading Holster and Vorpal Weapon. Both have Assault Mag, and I'm comboing them with Palmyra B with Auto Loading Holster and Explosive Light. On the Heritage, I don't have Recombination, but I'll simulate that later on in the video. For Izanagi Rocket, I'm using the same rocket launcher along with a truth teller with auto loading holster and quick draw. Here are the armor mods that I'm using for the comparison. And for anybody wondering, quick charge is an arc charge with light mod that gives you extra handling for your shotguns if you activate the secondary perk. For the damage test, here are the damage numbers for the two slugs, and then here are the Izanagi, Truth Teller, and Palmyra B numbers. For the rocket launcher, I'm going to assume that you have a teammate running Galar Horn. One thing to keep in mind is that my weapon swap rotations shown here are done in situations where there's no pressure on me which means that my swap rotations can be near optimal. These can be replicated one to one easily in boss fights like Templar, Tanix, or Kali but will likely require adjustments for a boss fight like Rolk. Your rotations may also vary depending on your mod setup, weapon perks, and any auto reloading mechanisms like Hunter Dodge, Dragon's Shadow, and Whisper of Impetus. In this damage comparison, I'm not using any auto reloading mechanisms. As you can see, Double Slug can output higher DPS and total damage than Izanagi Rocket. Here's the graph for DPS over time. As I mentioned before, I don't have recombination on my heritage, but if you did, this is what the graph would look like. Also, a lot of people were asking me about the Izanagi Rocket DPS if you don't use a third weapon, and here's what that looks like. So Double Slug looks to be the highest weapon DPS right now, but obviously there are caveats and trade-offs that I'm going to list out as if I was listing out side effects in a prescription drug commercial. I will also be writing this in the description. As I said before, the double slug swap rotation will vary depending on your build. Just for fun, here's an example of a rotation using Dragon's Shadow and Double Utility Kickstart. And here's the DPS for that. Anyways, I hope you found this video useful. Peace.